We've got holiday parties, we've got events. Maybe you wanna wear a sleeveless top or dress. Hey, that's what this workout is all about today. My name's Tracy Steen, this is Move Daily Fitness, and in today's workout, I wanna give you my best of arms and shoulder workout. Okay, so we're hitting biceps, triceps, shoulders. We wanna sculpt those arms and shoulders so that you feel confident and sexy wearing a sleeveless tank top or dress and moving into your holiday parties with confidence. I want you to grab the lightest weight you have, okay? My lightest is fives. I wish I had threes. I'm doing this with fives. We're gonna do a sequence of eight, a lot of shoulder exercises to warm up. All right, let's start with an overhead press right here. Feet are shoulder width apart, stand nice and tall. You're pressing for eight right above the head right there. So again, really light, because we're just getting everything warmed up, ready for our heavier lifts, all right? One more right here. Good, all right, let's move it to an upright row. Shoulders back, lift elbows high. That's it, right there. <clears throat> I like this little warm up. I often do this sequence when it's a shoulder day for myself or my clients. Last one here. Good, lateral raises, shoulders back, and pop it up. You just, again, we're going over the actions that we're gonna be doing heavier. Just a little light so the muscles and joints know what they're doing. One more here. Let's go to a front raise and lift it up right in front there. Good. <clears throat> Stick your chest out. Last two. And eight. Good. All right, I want palms up. We're gonna go a little rotator cuff right out to the side here. That's it. Two more. All right, hinge at the waist. We're gonna do rounded arms, a little reverse fly up for eight right there. Okay, retract the shoulder blades. <clears throat> Last one. All right, little shoulder roll right here and I want palms up and you're gonna press towards me right like that. Last one here. All right, one hand is on your chest. You're just gonna do a big rotation with a single arm. You can eliminate the weight if you want. Okay, just stretching up. We're gonna go eight backwards. That's eight there and switch directions. Up for eight here. Nice and slow if you've got a heavier weight. You just, again, go wanna get that ball and socket warmed up. Woo, now it's burning. One more right here, nice. All right, switch arms, up for eight. <clears throat> All right, forward, last eight here. And I just wanna give you a few exercises for buys and tries, just to warm that up as well. Last one here, good. Whew, little burn. Okay, all the way at the bottom, palms up. Let's come up all the way up to the top. Again, if you're holding threes, this is gonna be super light. You just wanna get the action in. We're gonna hit skipping first to get our heart rates up a little bit more, blood pumping. All right, that's eight. Take it overhead, tricep, press for eight here. Two more. Now again, if you don't have a rope, I want you to do high knees or you can just do faux skipping. Okay, you can just pretend there. So grab your rope. I'm just gonna go ahead and, again, 10 seconds in between. It's not long to transition. We're gonna stay here for two rounds to get our hearts ready to go for this workout. Let's go. Oh, don't hit the Christmas tree. Okay, you can skip however you like. I'm just gonna do a little variety, round one here. On the break, 
Pulse it out right here. Okay, a little pulse. We're gonna go right back into skipping, so don't let your rope go. In three, two, here we go. Whoops. High knees this time. I'm gonna do hammer curls to start. Biceps, ready, all the way up and down. Just like that, good. Now, you only have 30 seconds, but don't rush through the action, especially if you're lifting a little heavier here. Okay, still want that nice one to two counts up, little pause at the top, and nice slow on the descent, okay? Boom, just like that. All right, take one, put it down. You're gonna go into a skull crusher for triceps. I've got my 15, it's up and over the head. Knees soft, elbows close, press here. Great. Flex at the top there. Halfway. I'm gonna grab a little lighter for the next exercise. It's gonna be a shoulder exercise. I'll get my eights. Five seconds here. Last one. Boom. Good. All right. Single side down. Both are gonna be up above the head. We're gonna drop one at a time. Ready and let's go. Drop it to 90 degrees. That's it. Now, if you feel like you're arching your back, Go ahead and take one step back. Okay, that's fine. Halfway. Skipping is next. More high knees, whatever cardio you choose. In four, three, two, and time. Good. All right, setting those down. Back to high knees on your rope. Ready, and let's go. Again, 15s for me. Whew. Palms up, bicep. Bottom, all the way up, all the way down. That's it. Keep your elbows tucked in close. Okay. Up. Shoulders back. All right, grabbing my eights, medium weight. We're gonna do some tricep kickouts. Elbows are out here, kicking out and extending the arm. Ready, out, and don't shrug the shoulders. Keep your chest out. Elbows are lower than your chest, okay? Good. 
fue little front lateral combo coming up. I'm gonna hold my same weights here. Three, two, and rest. Shoulder roll. Okay, so knees are soft. One is coming out to the side while the other one comes right to the front, okay? Ready, alternate, boom, and up. That's it. Get both up to 90 degrees. Halfway. I made my client do this with a 10 this morning. <laughs> this eight is heavy. That was mean of me. Last one. Good. All right, let's go back to skipping. Two rounds. Ready and start. High knees. Jacks on your skip coming up. Three, two, let's go. Wide and narrow. Don't pee. Have a client always pees at this point. <laughs> I shouldn't laugh. Somehow I left out with three babies. I don't have that problem, but I know it's gone. Ten seconds. Good. All right, pinwheel curls. Grab your heavy, 15s, 12s. Knees are soft. Curl in front. Pull it up. Good, flex those bags at the top. Don't swing. Wherever it lands, that's where it lands. Up. Two shoulder ones this round. So I'm gonna grab my light ones to start because I'm gonna do a valley press just like I did at the beginning. So fives, threes, here we go. Boom, just like that. Surprisingly, this is hard to do for a long period of time. Keep your body nice and still. Stick your chest out. That's it. Side views there, boom. Keep it at parallel. Woohoo! Feel the biceps in that too, eh? Mmm. Last one. Moving back to my eights. I'm gonna do a bent arm lateral. Arms start like this. Come up behind the head and like that. Ready. Ha. Go and in. That's it. Your arms bent. I bring the dumbbell slightly behind my head. I can really feel my medial delt, that side shoulder cap, flexing when I'm there. Otherwise, sometimes we tend to use the scapula and hit a little back. That's it, good. All right, not horrible. Back to your skipping. Okay, front and back ski skip. Let's go. Like a cross country skier. Good, pulse it out. One more 
Get low. Pulse, pulse. All right. Let's go for high knees again. Whoops. here. Right like that. Good. Palms are up and flex. Sorry that moved really fast. My computer went black and I had, to, had a lot to do in that 10 seconds. And pull. Good. Try some kickback. Come up next. Let me grab my eights for that. Last one here. Curl. Good. Whew. Okay, hinge at the waist, butt out, chest out, kick it back, right there. Next, I'm gonna hold these same eights for that. We're gonna do alternating palm up, palm down. Okay, so I'm gonna come up with this palm, down with that one, then I'll switch. Get it? <laughs> Ready? Here we go. Up, turn, wrist, up. Like, it doesn't do a whole heck of a lot of difference except for when you turn your palm. Up palm, I'm hitting the inside of my anterior delt. Down palm, I'm hitting the outside. Funny. Eh? Mm, no swinging. Up. Up. Can you stay here with me? One more out of this, since it was that fun. Okay, pulse this out here. Yeah, let's do that again, okay? Just the one, then we'll go back to skipping. Hey, I'm running the show, I get to, I get to do that. Here we go. One up, one down. I'm gonna fatigue this out a bit more. I quite like it. Chest out though. As soon as you start to feel like you're rounding, stick that chest out. Good. Up. Gotta lift heavy if you wanna have those sculpted look in that tank top dress. Last one here. Up, nice. Okay, back to skipping. Woo. Okay, skipping skip, ready, here we go. Remember you can do high knees, modified high knees for low impact. So many options, so little time. 10 seconds. Okay, squat it out. I keep hitting my tree. Don't fall over tree. It's already leaning one way. I'm sure of it. Ready, and skip and skip again. There's one side at the bottom. Like where you put the tree into, that's cracked. Problem. Pick up the pace if you can. Woo! Yeah! Nice. Biceps. Let's get that big one again. All right, halfway up, down only, up, down, good. Did we do this one already? No, we did full range. Oh, why did I grab 15s? This is hard. Bring it up to 90 degrees only, and let it swing down. 
Sorry, don't let it swing, just place it down. Let's work. Try some dips next. Find a place to dip it do, okay? Up. Good. I'm just gonna come on the side of my couch here. Go wherever is good. Ready. And you see? Here we go. More difficult if you put your legs out. Quite a bit. Oh yeah. Put one leg out. This hurts my wrist a bit, but not horrible. Reverse flies are next. I think I'm gonna grab my 15s for that. Stay close to your bench, four seconds. Okay, good. Uh, rounded arms, okay? Hinge at the waist, rounded arms, reverse flies, ready, go. Working rear delts, put your mind in your back shoulder. Try not to bob your body up. It's heavy. It's work for me. Oh, All right, good. Woo! Skip. Okay, two skips here, then a little water break. Ready, Jack. Wide and close. You can kick that foot back if you want as well. Jack, kick, kick. Okay, something different. Tied there. Same thing, one more round, then a break. Three, two, let's go. Ah, she lays him in. I just switch my skip. Slight forward lean and press right here. All right, I want your biceps to come up by your ears. Press. Oh, that forward lean just puts so much gravity on the dumbbells. You've got to work so hard to keep them parallel. This is a good one. I like it. We're gonna do a full shoulder circuit right here. Three different exercises, so get ready for it. Shoulders will be burning. Ooh, yeah, good. Grab your heavier ones, upright row. I've got my 15s here. These are soft. 15 up here, ready. Let's go, boom, and elbows are higher than your wrists. You've got a full range of motion, lateral raise after this. Ten seconds, watch your face. Can you imagine if you just clocked yourself in the chin? So I have really sexy arms in my tank dress, but uh, my chin is broken. <laughs> Bad dates all over my chin. Uh, eights for me. I'm trying it. I'm going all out. Okay, all the way up here and down. Let's go. Put your ear, go ahead. Up, up. This is like Chevy Chase in Christmas Vacation. It was like, go, 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 go. He plugs in the plug in. That's our family tradition to watch that. We'll be watching it on Christmas Eve. I always fall asleep, let's be honest. But the kids, they love it. And everyone knows every word up by heart. Oh, it warms the heart. 
It really warms the heart. We're gonna do three more shoulder exercises because you can. So no skipping right now, just hold that weight. All right, another full three shoulder exercises. Full range of motion, front raise is next. I've got my eights, ready, and let's go. I just wanna burn up these shoulders and that's a big part of progressively overloading the muscle. You don't wanna just leave it, go skip. You wanna work it, work it, load it. Let it adapt to the muscle or the weights that you're lifting. Of course, you know that what you eat is gonna help them show even better. So make sure you pay attention to nutrition as well. Ugh. Slow, slow, nice. Whew. Okay, full this rotator cuff. Okay, this is gonna build that little side shoulder cap right there on the side. Palms up, knees soft. Let's go. Open and boom. Finishing this threesome here. Threesome? <laughs> Never mind. Finishing this section, what? With an Arnold press. I'm not even editing that one out because I make, I make a lot of mistakes. Someone said, it's fun to see your bloopers at the end now, Tracy. I'm like, yeah, just a portion of all the mistakes I make throughout these videos. Boo. Okay, Arnold press, grabbing my 15s. Go heavy or go home. It's only 30 seconds, then we're skipping. Okay, up, start palms facing the face. Turn, press, bring it in 90 degrees. Press. That's it. Ooh, it's heavy. That's it. We can do it though. Eight seconds. Three, two, time. Okay, let's skip. Whew. Hi knees, let's get the heart rate up after a break here. Let's go. Boom, 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 let's go. Okay, same side. Let's go. 30 seconds aside. Up. 
and down. Yes. No swinging at the bottom of this. Your tendency might be to turn to the side on that push. I'm using a 15 here. I want to keep my core tight and stable. Use my shoulder, boom, to press. Good. Yeah, switch sides, good. Whew. Are your arms floating yet? Almost. Ready, and go. Work, work. The last exercise before we skip again, you're gonna go into plank position. Okay, you're gonna do a reverse fly, tricep kick, kick back combo. 30 seconds aside on that as well, okay? I'm gonna use my eight for that. This side feels stronger. Especially on that press, it's not even a problem. Interesting how that works, eh? Okay, reverse fly, plank position. Same side for 30 seconds. So you're here, you're rounding, bend, kick, start, round. Bend, kick. This can be done from knees, okay? If you need to. Woo! Feel that in the core too. Good. Switch sides. In three, two, work. circuit. You're going to do a hammer curl shoulder press simultaneously. So one up, one down, then they're going to come together, then you're switching spots. Ready? Knee soft. Together and switch. Together, switch. Knees are soft so you don't use your back. Boom. Look at my 15s here. Challenging on that press. Halfway. Row to bat wing extension coming up. Grab your lighter weights. I've got eights. Okay, you're gonna roll up. Elbows out. Kick it out. In and down. Hinge forward. Let's go. Up. Kick. In. Down. Neutral neck now, look at the ground. Good, up, kick. All right, 
continuing with triceps. We had this one at the beginning, I'm gonna hold my eights, elbows close to my ears, and overhead single side presses here. Ready, here we go. Well, not single side, you're doing them at the same time, but you're holding separate weights, so whatever your weak arm can hold, that's what you're doing, okay? Up, press. Keep your elbows as close as you can. I see in the mirror that one wants to go out on me. Good. Two rounds of skipping coming up. Okay, Woo. work, grab your rope. All right, high knees, let's go. Get them way up because next round we're butt kicking, okay? Right here only. Ready, go, pulse. So even if you hold it, isometric contraction in that 90 degrees, I'm happy with that. Otherwise a little pulse here. Just a one inch pulse. Woo, Ur earn. Yeah, that's a killer. These are soft. Come on, in three, two, one. Set that down, swing it out if you need. Okay, a little pulse in the tricep kickback. So hinge at the waist. Ready, you're here, up, up, up. Even if you just hold the tricep, you just want a little pulse here. Oh, I should have five. What was I thinking? Neutral neck. We did this in a workout not too long ago. Pulse, pulse, pulse. Ready, here we go. Palms facing, neutral, wide. But no full extension this time. Front, neutral, wide, boom. That's it. Oh, I'm gonna need to stretch my neck out. I can feel it already. Almost there, last 10 seconds. Pulse, come on. Go, go. Don't drop now. Four, three, two, one. Oh, yes! You and your sexy sculpted arms have moved daily. Darlene, that was fabulous. Let's just swing those arms a little bit just to get the blood flow back to the end of those extremities. Woo! That felt good. Hey, do you have a pump going on now? Look, you do that before your Friday night event, boom! You're gonna be walking in that room, everyone's gonna be go like, what? Look at her arms. Okay, let's bring that arm across here. You know what's funny though, is it doesn't happen overnight, as you know. Some people will Google, um, or YouTube, how to lose arm fat fast. How to lose arm fat in one week, and then it actually gives you a strategy. That doesn't work, you can't do this in one week. This is gonna be like progressive overload over time, weeks, months. Years, yes, and nutrition is paramount. So here's the thing about that, arms back, thumbs down, stretch those biceps. 
you can really sculpt and do really heavy weights and lift and do, a, do this workout multiple times a week for a year, but if you don't have your diet nutrition dialed in, you're just going to have a layer of excess fat over the arm, which is going to make the whole arm look bigger, right? So if you want it to look sculpted, you've got to really pay attention to the diet. Of course, we do offer um, education on diets and nutrition. So if you want to go ahead and click the card at the top of the screen, you can jump over to that little program. Uh, we talk about not only what you need to do in terms of educating yourself on your macronutrients, your portions, how to eat, when to eat, but also on, let's put our hand behind the back, if you're overeating and you don't know why, if you can't figure that part out, we talk about that too, because in my mind, that is key. Like if you've gone on a million diets and they haven't worked, don't you dare go on one more until you figure out why you're overeating in the first place. Switch sides, tilt your neck. Um, that is, that's just the foundation, right? You've got to kind of, not even kind of, you've got to figure out yourself um, to be blunt, you've got to figure out your shit and you've got to get that together and you've got to be at a path and a strategy of changing that part of your life and when you get that going, and it could mean going to a therapist and it could mean, give yourself a hug here, um, it could be reading uh, books to help you move through that, it could be talking to a good friend, uh, it could be a process of going through a course where you unpack some of the things in your life that are causing you to um, stop or give up or you know, jump off the way again. There's lots of reasons. But as a former therapist and now as a trainer, that is the key. That's the key, girls. You gotta figure that out. Anyway, I can help you with that if you want that. Just click the card at the top of the screen. You can take a look over there. All right, that was awesome. My arms feel great. Hey, by the way, one of those dresses that I wore, this one right here, that's like 15 years old. And it still fits me, which is testament to the fact that if you move daily, and your fitness, wellness, and nutrition. You can stay healthy and lean and fit for the rest of your life forever and ever, amen. All right, I'll see you in the next video.